Hey guys, my name is Moy. I'm the executive director of the Hope Center. Thank you so much for joining us for these three weeks of getting in shape. It's been a while for me. It's been about a year since I've actually exercised. So you're gonna see me doing some of the modified exercises. And if you need to step back and do some of the modified exercises, please feel free to, if you need to take a break. Or please consult with your doctor to make sure that all of this is gonna be safe uh, for you to begin with. Well, if you guys are ready, let's do this. You guys ready? Yeah, I'm ready. All right, guys, thanks. All right, so let's get started. The first thing I'd like to do is introduce myself. My name is Beverly, and I've got the dream team here, Moy and Eva. So we are going to get started and have a lot of fun and exercise our bodies. Let's do it. All right, so the first thing that I want you to do is put your feet shoulder width apart and we're going to go down in a squat and reach up, okay? Very simple, all right? We're gonna get warmed up, we're warming up our trunk and we're reaching to the sky, all right? Get those knees cracking, all right? We got some crack, uh, snap, crackle, and pop. <laughs> all right, a couple more here. And what we're gonna do now is we're gonna move to a squat and a toe tap. All right, so again, get down and tap your toe. All right, we're gonna sit here for a little bit. Tap that toe. Now, are you guys with me? Yeah. Oh yeah, looking good. Hey, we're, gonna, go <laughs> we're gonna move into a butt kick. So you're basically gonna stay in the same position, but I just want you to heel to glue. All right, are we getting warm? Yep. All right. Now, we're gonna take this up to a run. Are you ready? Ready. All right, here we go. Let's get up to a run. We're gonna hold here for about 10 seconds. If you want, you can get your heel up to the butt, okay? Now we're feeling it. Keep going. All right, five, four, three, two, one. All right, great job. The last thing we're gonna do in the warm up is our shoulders and upper body. Let's do some small, arm circles here, okay? Get that upper body warmed up. Good job, everybody. We're gonna have a lot of fun today. Let's reverse, reverse arm circles. All right, very good. The last thing we're gonna do is what's called a twist and clap. You're gonna twist and clap, all right? So we're moving our trunk a little bit, getting that upper body warmed up. Almost done with our warm up here, guys. Three more, two and one. All right, are we ready? Yeah. Good job. All right, so we're gonna move into the first tri set, which means we're gonna do three exercises and then we're gonna repeat that set, all right? So the first exercise on the tricep is called a kickstand squat, all right? And what you're going to do is you're gonna put your lead leg forward and you're gonna use the other leg like a kickstand, okay? And so about 80% of your weight is on this lead leg, okay? You can hold your hands up front, prayer position, and you're just gonna go down and push through the heel. All right, so that's the first move. The second move is called a good morning. What you're gonna do is your legs are shoulder width apart. You can cross your, your hands across your chest and you're gonna do what's called a hip hinge and you're gonna just tip over. And the, the strength of your hamstrings and your glute is gonna bring you back up, all right? So those are called good mornings. Now, if you wanna add a weight, one of us might be adding a weight to that. You are welcome to do that. But this is a good morning. Then the third move is called a pike toe touch. And what that is, is you're gonna be in a pike position, which is a upside down V, essentially. 
and you are, your feet are wide and you are going to touch your toe. Okay? We're gonna do 12 of those. All right? So now I've demonstrated the moves and we're gonna do the first tricep together. Are you ready? Who's ready? ready? Let's do it. Okay, so get one foot up. You're gonna put the other foot back. Okay, not a lot of weight on that back foot. And here we go. We're gonna go down for 10. 10, 9, 8, 7, chest up, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. All right, reverse. We're going to do the other leg. Kick that. Not a lot. You, can, you should be able to lift up your foot. All the, a lot of the weight is in the front foot. Here we go down for 12, or 10, <laughs> 9, 8, Seven, can you lift that back leg? Six, five, four, push through that heel. Three, two, and one. Very good. All right, that is the kickstand squat. Let's move on to the good morning. I'm gonna grab a weight just to demonstrate how you would do that. And I'm gonna turn on the side. These guys are gonna stay forward, but here's how we're gonna do the good morning. Your feet are shoulder width apart. Tip your hips to the back of the room, the side of the room for me, but you're gonna tip over and let your glutes do all the work. Here we go. One, two, three. You should be able to wiggle your toes at this point. What number are we on, guys? Four, five, six, Weight in the heels. Do not let your back do the work. We got eight, nine, we're going to 12, 10, 11, and 12. Great job, great job. All right, now let's move into those, uh, the pike toe touch. All right, feet wide. All right, basically glutes in the air. Here we go, one. Two. Now, Moy is doing a modification because of an injury, and you are free to do that modification. All right. Eva, what number are we on? Eight. Nine. Ten. We're going to twelve. Eleven. And twelve. All right. Great job, guys. We are going to repeat that. Okay, we're going to repeat every tricep. So we're going back to the kickstand squat. You might want to reverse the leg that you started on. That's up to you. But here we go. Lead leg, put that foot back. And here we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Great job. How are you guys feeling? Good. Good. Awesome. All right, here we go. Warm it up. 10, nine. And when I say chest up, I mean I should be able to see what's on your shirt, okay? Six, five, four, three, push through the heel, two, and one. All right, very good. Now we're on to good mornings. Grab a small weight if you've got it, if you want. If not, totally fine. Ready, send your hips to the back of the room. Back straight, head neutral. And you've just got a micro bend in your knees, which means don't lock out your knees, just a little bend. Four, five, all the power is coming from your glutes and hamstrings. That's seven, eight, Nine, 10, two more, 11, 12. Great job. All right, let's finish this off with our pike toe touch. And boy, let me see what you're doing back there. Excellent, that is perfect. All right, here we go. Wide stands. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, 
10, 11, last one, 12. All right. You guys are fantastic. Woo! Woo! All right, so first set is done. Now we're gonna move down to the mat for an ab set. Are you ready? Let's hit it. So down here on the mat, we are going to do a few exercises where our legs are out and we're gonna do flutters, then we're gonna do scissors, and then we're gonna do a figure eight. Here's what it looks like. Flutters are going to be like this. Okay, we're gonna do 25 of those. We're gonna take a five second break. Then we're going to do scissors, right? And then we're going to do figure eights. Here's what figure eights look like. You are making a figure eight with your feet. All right? Now, modifications include, you can be on your elbows, or you can put your legs higher up. That puts less stress on your back, all right? So your flutters are up here. You can even bend your legs a little bit, okay? And do flutters from here. All right, so those are your modification options. Are you ready to go? Let's hit it. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Oh, all right, five second break. All right, now we're gonna go into scissors. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Woo! All right, I'm gonna stop right here and you're gonna get longer than a five second break. I want to tell you that when you do ab work, it is really important for your core and to do them properly by sucking your belly button to your spine. I want you to think, okay, mind to body connection, your belly button to your spine, okay? So when we do that again, let's, oh sorry, we're gonna go into figure eights. Let's finish that first. Uh, the modification for a figure eight is you can actually bend one knee and just do the figure eight with one foot, all right? You can do that. All right, so let's, let's go ahead and I want you to think of what you're doing with your abs when you're doing these figure eights. One, two, we're gonna do four and then we're gonna reverse direction. Three and four, let's reverse direction. We're gonna go four the other way. One, two, oh, these are hard. Three, yes. And four. Was your figure eight really big? <laughs> the idea is to get it as small as possible. So great job on the ab workout. All right, great job. We are now going to move into the final tri set. You guys are doing fantastic. So the next three moves, the first move is a flare push-up. If you're familiar with push-ups, all this is, is your hands are more like goalposts, really wide, all right? So your hands are wide. A modification, if you want to be on your knees, feel free to do that. And if you, we'll talk about the final modification at the end, but you're basically going to be out wide, all right? That's a flare push-up. Uh, and boy, what are you gonna do? Just the modified version. You're gonna do the modified version, great. All right, so then we are going to move into what's called a side plank with hug, all right? So you're going to be up on your side, arm up, and you're going to dip below. We're gonna do eight of those on each side. A modification, you can rest your hips right there, and the intensity of this move is just as good, all right? That is the second move. The final move, is what's called a side-to-side -side hop. Super easy. Side-to-side -side hop, imagine you have a, a rope laying right here, and we are just gonna hop side-to-side. -side. Now, if you wanna modify, you can step, all right? But we're gonna do hops, all right, for a more advanced move, okay? So let's go and do our final tricep together. Let's get back down here. All right, remember we're gonna do the flare push-up first. Arms are wide, head is neutral, which means it stays in line with the spine. Here we go, we're doing 10. 10, nine, 
eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Great job, guys. Let's move in to the side plank. Here we go, get those hips up. Everybody ready? Arms up, give yourself a hug. Two, three. You should feel this in your abs, your shoulders. There is a lot working here. Six, seven, and eight. Great job. My body didn't want to cooperate with me. <laughs> Moi and Eva are doing fantastic. Here we go. Are you guys ready for second set? Ready. Arm up. Hug. Oh yeah. We're feeling the love. Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. You guys are doing fantastic. Fantastic. Let's go. We're gonna move into those hops. Here we go, we're doing 15. One, two, three, four. Get over that line. Six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Great job. All right, we've got a finisher. Stay tuned. We've got a finisher coming up. All right, you guys have done fantastic. We've got a finisher for you, all right? So we're just taking a break for a couple seconds here. Towel off if you need it. Take a drink of water. You are almost done. So are we good? Yeah, we're good. Awesome, everybody's with me. Our finisher today is going to include three moves, all right? And it's going to be, it's going to be timed and we are gonna put the timer on for one minute. Moy's got our timer. And you are going to do the following moves. You are going to do a plank shoulder tap. You're going to get in a plank and you are going to tap your shoulders four times. Okay, four, sh four shoulder taps. Then you're going to do four in and outs. Here's what an in and out looks like. Okay, you're in a plank position. I'm doing this from the side so you can see. Okay, modified version is just stepping it out. All right, and then the final move is for pencil jumps, right? Stay narrow. All right, so we've got shoulder taps. We have, <clears throat> excuse me, in and outs and pencil jumps. All right, are you guys ready? Let's do this. Right. How's our timer? Hey, Google, one minute timer. All right, series with us. All right, let's do this. Here we go. Four shoulder taps. Ready? One, two. You guys move at your own pace. In and out. One. Three count on your own. Jumps. We're doing pencil jumps. Four. One. Three. Back down for shoulder taps. Here we go. Four shoulder taps. We've got in and outs next. Go at your own pace. Pencil jumps. All right. Shoulder taps. Shoulder taps, in and outs, and jumps. How are we doing? We're Boy, doing good. How many? We're doing really good. We're at seven, six seconds left. All right. Four. Three, two, one. Woo! Way to go. Take a walk around the room. Relax. You guys did it. You are awesome and amazing. Yes, yes. Thank you for joining us for week one. We can't wait to see you for week two. Yes.